Hello and welcome to a new tutorial. Today we will be making rock, paper, scissors in Python. So to start out, we, we need to handle the input. But before we do any of that, we, we want to define this as a function. Okay, so to do that, we just type in def and we're going to name the, the function rock, paper, scissors. And whatever's in here is part of the function. So to handle the input, we're going to do player equals input. And we're going to say enter rock, paper, or scissors. Okay, so now that we have that done, we need to make sure that the player input is rock, paper, scissors. So to do that, we will be using a while loop. So while not player equals rock or player equals paper or player equals scissors if this is the case what we want to do is we want to redo the input basically so we copy and paste you can say instead of enter you can we can say re-enter just so we know it it works and after that we need to get the CPU input so we're going to declare the CPU variable and for now it's just going to be an empty string and to get the the input from the CPU we need we want we obviously want it to be a random value so to do to do random values in Python we need to import random and what we're going to do is we're going to do ran it's going to be random dot rand int and this is going to be between 0 and 2 because there's only three possible values so we'll do an if statement now so if if oh sorry about that if ran equals 0 CPU will be equal to rock else if ran equals 1 CPU will equal paper and now here we can use else or else if I'll just use else if just in case ran equals 2 CPU equals CPU equals scissors Oops. Okay. So now we now we have the input from both the player and the CPU. So now we, what we want to do is we want to compare it. So we want to do another if statement. So if the player is equal to the CPU, we want to start all over again. But before we do that, we want to print a message and we're going to do print f and the string will be player and we're going to put between brackets the value for player which will be rock paper scissors and we can do versus cpu cpu is put in capital letters cpu and this will be again between brackets cpu and we'll say it's a tie and basically to run this again what we're going to do is simply we're just going to call again the rock paper scissors function and it's going to start all over so now what we want to do is we want to compare to do the least amount of comparisons we're just going to get the cases in which the cpu wins 
and then just one case in which the player wins which will be the else statement so we'll start with the uh, three else ifs so if player equals um, if player equals rock and CPU equals paper we're going to copy this basically CPU wins and now let's copy this as well and let's paste it twice actually let's paste it three times and in the second case, well, the third case, we want to do scissors rock. Here we want to do paper scissors. And here we want to directly get rid of this let's just put else and in this case the player wins so basically it, it's just uh, it takes less code to to just um, check for well first if if it's the same if the player and the CPU are the same and after to just check if the CPU wins or the player wins and if that's not the case just do an else and do for the other case basically so once we have that done we want to make sure we call a function so let's call the function and now this should work so so we have like we have some invalid syntax oh we i forgot to put here fit equals scissors my bad so let's enter something that's not correct like s for example it says re-enter rock paper scissors as you can see it works so let's try with rock and it says it's a tie so let's so it called the function again so it's it's working perfectly fine so let's try paper and as you can see the player won so as, as you can see it works just fine so if you have any suggestions for future videos, like if you have doubts or anything, make sure to comment down below. And if you enjoyed it, make sure to like and subscribe. So see you in the next one. Bye.